Hello guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Mimi. Today's episode we are coming to me from not sure. We do it locally. Please, if you are new to my channel, kindly subscribe, like, share, and comment. Thank you. We have our palm nuts. If you want it, we are coming to put it. We have our pepper, onion, and our fish that we use to make our palm nut soup. So let's start. Our palm nut is on fire now. So let's wait for it to cook. Then we pound it. Dress our smoked fish that we use for palm Dress the fish in the something like that. When you are done, you wash it neatly. Wash our fish very neatly. So, this is our second ingredient that's fish. So, I have my coats, I have my salted fish. In our local language, we call it kaku. That's what I will add. But you can add any fish of your choice to it. We are washing it. Very easy. You wash it thoroughly. Chopped into smaller pieces, you can chop it to any size you want. Our palm nut is boiling. We did everything on a coconut, we are coming to finish it on a coconut. So let's wait for our palm nut to cook, become soft, then we pound it, then we use it to make our palm nut soup. Let's wait. Our palm nut is cool and we are coming to pound it. You pour it in the water. That's the thing that you use to pound it. As a gangue, this is what I was taught by my mother when you are making palm nut soup in her. So this is what you do. You pour some in the water. We start slowly.
We have one empty bowl that we pour our pound of ingredients inside. You see how it's looking. We pounded it very well. Add, we are done. You add good pots and cold water to it to the quantity that you then do add some more. You start squeezing it. That's the hacks. So you see that. You get something like this. The quantity of water you add depends on how thick and light you want it. So I want it a little bit more. The water is more, I'll add a little more. Start taking the hacks, separating the hacks from the nuts as I'm doing. So this is the hacks, then I squeeze it. Make sure all the water is out from the hacks and you put it in a bowl. Or the mortar, you can pound it again, you can pound the hacks again if you want more soup. So you can pound it again. So you see it as I'm doing it using a colander. You see it has remained only the nut. That's how you do it. Then you beat the colander so that the water will drop into the bowl. What we use for our pan? You pour your pan a little bit to suspend your meat as a final method.
our permanent soup is ready please if you are new to my channel kindly subscribe like share and comment my name is Bimi, and this is taste good bye bye